it's a, it's a dream come true. If this don't even feel real to me right now. I'm glad I got the opportunity. Appreciate my coaches and my family for helping me get to this point. It's just a crazy feeling. You said Brian Kelly offered you in person. What was that conversation like, and what did he really say that sold you on going to the Tigers? Coach BK, the first thing that he told me is that he he, he would love for me to be a Tiger. And the, this, the first thing I told him is I, I am going to be a Tiger. So that, that day I knew for a fact that I was going to be a Tiger, and I, I knew forever that me and Coach Kelly was going to have that relationship as, as, as far as any other coach too. Um, being able to build a relationship with those guys is amazing. I knew LSU is home, it's always been home, and I'm going to stay home. The fact that you get to go there and now you're getting to be a part of DBU with Coach Corey Raymond, how much of that was also a factor? It, 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 it was a big factor because, you know, LSU is known for sending DBs to the league. I'm trying to go to the league. That's a goal. So just, just, just taking that into consideration, I knew that was going to be the school for me. What did Coach Raymond or Coach Baker, any of the coaches, talk to you about in terms of their vision for you as a part of that defense and kind of the plan once you get there? Um, the the wait, say that again, please. Just in terms of the plan, fit, vision for you, what did the coaches share with you about how they see things playing out for you once you actually get up to bat? They, they they see me playing the uh, the deep safety for sure. They see me roaming from uh, sideline to sideline, making some big plays in Death Valley. The fact that you get this meteoric rise after one year in the defensive backfield, how thrilling is it feel for you to have this commitment already with one year as a safety? Uh, this, this is crazy. I never, I actually never thought that I'd be here. Um, I, I, I just prayed to God every day. All glory to God. Um, I wouldn't be here without him, and I wouldn't be, I, I wouldn't be here without my parents and my trainers and my coaches. So I thank all of them tremendously, and I, I, I'm, I'm blessed. You gave us a couple pump fix up there, man. Did you want to do Ole Miss first to have a little fun with your dad? Yeah. <laughs> he, he, he went to Ole Miss. He was he was an uh, old rebel, so I had to kind of pick that one first. Um, a lot of people predicted me to go there, and I just, you know, I, I wanted to flash that hat first. How stressful has the process been in picking a school that you want to go to? Uh, the, the, the process is really stressful. Um, the coach is calling you every day, waking you up in the morning. Coach is texting you every day. Um, Coaches pitching different things at you to try to get you to come to the school. You got to figure out who's real and who's not. And LSU was just that school for me. And what did they say that really let you know they were real compared to the others? Well, let them know that they was that that they was real. It was just a relationship. The relationship thing. You could tell what bonds are 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 really real, and you could tell what bonds are. You know, they just trying to get you out there. So being being that, I was able to talk to Coach Kelly and the rest of the defensive staff. Every, every single day ever, since they offered me was just uh, like, I, I knew it was going to be LSU. And to touch on your dad one more time, obviously he has a lot of success in history in the defensive backfield. Mm -hmm. How much has he really been a help with your success so far playing the safety position? He was the first ever coach to teach me how to play DB going into my junior year. I had to, I had to, I was, it was countless amount of days that I was on the field trying to learn how to do different techniques and stuff. And he was always there to teach me how to do it. You mentioned folks potentially thinking Ole Miss might have been it because of that. How big of a factor was Houston in this down the stretch as, as hot as they've been recruiting a lot of guys you know from this state? Houston was a, a big factor in my recruitment. They've been recruiting me hard since my sophomore year, also coming from Tulane. Um, they, they never stopped recruiting me hard since day one. Um, it, nothing really changed with them. I have really strong relationships over there, and I'm, I'm glad that they recruited me because they, they, they played a big factor in my recruitment. As fast rising as you've been the last year, how much ceiling have we still not seen? Um, just, I mean, your potential moving forward when you get to college. My senior season for sure gonna be a movie. I'm, I can't wait to go into my, uh, my 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 first game week one. Some of you guys seen a preview of it in the spring game, so I I, I can't wait. As far as mentality on the field, what can LSU fans expect? They they expect the uh, they they should expect the, the blue chip mentality. I feel like I got a chip on my shoulder. I'm gonna forever feel like I got a chip on my shoulder. Every time I step on the field, I I, I feel like I got a I got something to prove, and that's that's the way I, that's the way I play. How big is it for you to get this commitment locked in for the start of your senior season? Um, it's a, it's an amazing feeling to get it done before the season because I knew my recruitment was gonna get even bigger during my senior season, but I already had my mind made up at the camp. Right on. The ones that LSU offered you that was kind of new that that was where you guys where you were going. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And uh, what are your expectations for your senior season at Nestor My expectations is to go win a, a state championship. For sure, for sure. And you, uh, the deep safety, that's uh, that's your position that you've locked in on, that you plan on playing for the foreseeable future? Yes, sir. Um, deep safety is going to be my position in college, but you will see me at multiple positions this year. For sure.
happened. So you have a teammate making an announcement in a few hours, and LSU is one of his finalists. How much have you talked to Billy? I mean, leading all the way up to today and trying to push him. We haven't really had any conversations about where we were going. We try to keep it as secretive as possible. Um, I, I really haven't even told my parents till today. So, uh, but now I know he's going to be watching this, and he know where home is for sure. What were mom and dad's reactions when you told them that you thought about it and this is what you wanted to do? Because parents love it when their their guys stay close to them. Mom and dad's, my, especially my mom. My mom doesn't want me to go too far, and it, it, family plays a big factor in recruiting. So. Um, I just wanted to, my family to be happy as far as me also, and you know my goal is to take care of them when I'm older. So that's my that's my job.